Hello and welcome to the second part of the Mangalyaan series. In this video, we are going to learn about Mangalyaan's orbital path and the mechanics behind it. Mangalyaan is put into the Earth's orbit as soon as it gets separated from the payload fairing. When the spacecraft is away from the Earth, its velocity decreases and the velocity of the spacecraft increases when it is closer to the Earth and that happens because of Earth's gravitational pull. When the spacecraft is closer to the Earth, that is, when it is on the other side of the Earth, the engine is fired so that its orbit is raised or increased. It does six main engine burns and after the sixth burn, it gains escape velocity to escape the sphere of influence of the Earth. The area around the planet that has the maximum gravitational pull is called the sphere of influence of that planet and the velocity required to escape this is called the escape velocity. When Mars is in the right position, the spacecraft, which is in purple in this video, leaves the Earth in a direction which is tangential to the Earth's orbit and this injection is called the translunar injection. Now, we know that Newton's first law says that an object will continue to be at motion until a force is acted upon it. So, fuel is needed only to correct the trajectory of the spacecraft. And this maneuver is called the trajectory correction maneuver. I have given more information about Newton's first law in my other video, so make sure to watch that as well. Once Mangalyaan reaches the Martian sphere of influence, it does something which is called the mass orbit insertion. In this insertion, the spacecraft trajectory is corrected and made to enter the Martian orbit. The cost of this mission was approximately 72 million US dollars. On September 2018, Mangalyaan completed a thousand days in the Martian orbit although the design life of the orbiter was only 6 months. The probe continues to work nominally until today and has taken over a thousand pictures. And the most important fact is that the mission was accomplished in a single try, whereas many space agencies took several attempts to achieve it. Thanks for watching this video. If you liked it, make sure to like, share and also leave your comments and suggestions in the comment section. I'll see you in the next video.